Hi, welcome back to the channel. My name is Tayo, and in today's video, we're going to be talking about the DJI mic and why it makes sense or not. Today, we're going to be breaking this down into three aspects. One is the design. Second is the functionality. How are you going to use this thing? And lastly, we're going to be talking about the sound, which is perhaps the most important part of this feedback. First thing I want to say about this microphone is the design. The design feels very premium. I am not gonna lie. I've watched the reviews, tons of them, but it feels different in person. The first time I opened up this case and I brought out the transmitters, I was like, oh my God, this thing is small. I knew it was small, but I wasn't expecting it to be this small, um, which is a good thing because the form factor just means that you're able to use this in a lot more versatile way than you would use the others. Maybe, maybe not, but it's smaller is better. Just in general, the whole design of this thing is pretty rugged and you should be rest assured that um, this thing is gonna stand the test of time. Going off of the design as well, another thing that is very impressive about this thing is this, the magnet. It is so strong. <laughs> just, I mean, look at this, look at this. It just stays, it stays, and it doesn't come off. And the magnet seems to be strong. It doesn't look like it's gonna fall off. Let me jump, that's, wow. This thing's not gonna fall. It's, it's sturdy. What else can I do with this thing? It also has the clip clipper thing um, that you can put on your subject when you're trying to mic them up. Is this gonna fall? If it does fall, we in trouble, y'all. One extra feature that I also like, and I think it's great that companies are starting to think about this. For example, it's the screen on the transmit, on the receiver. It works exactly how you would expect it to work, and that's what I appreciate about this thing. It's clear, it's very visible, even in bright sunlight. So you don't have to worry about not seeing what you're doing or whatever, and it's just easy that you're able to change all the settings right from the screen there. It's so easy and just going off of everything all of this whole design is so impeccable because of this case this charging case makes everything about this microphone exotic now let's go to the functional side of things this thing can run for 25 hours you get five hours off of the transmitter you get 5.5 hours off of the receiver and you get 15 hours straight up using this case. That's 25 hours. Nobody's gonna be recording audio for 25 hours straight. Even when you are using one of the transmitter and it starts to get low, you can just put that back here into the box, swap it for the second one. While this one is charging, you keep using the second one. And it's just, it's like a constant flow. DJI says that the range on this thing is 250 meters. But the truth is, no one is gonna be using this microphone at 250 meters. What are you doing? What are you doing? What do you mean, what are you doing? We're testing out the mic, that's what it's made. Matter of fact, we're gonna do 250 miles right now. If DJI gives us 250 meters, who are you to tell me or anybody else that what are we doing? How do I know it's 250? I've used the DJI microphone now consistently for the space of a week and a half, two, and I haven't had any interference issue, except for this one time that it did this. Oh, I need to sync the audio. I still think that's a mystery because I don't know what happened, why it happened, I do not know. I tried exactly the same thing I did before and that didn't happen again. I, I don't know. Another interesting thing about this mic is even though it's a wireless system and you wanna be sending your feed live to the camera, this thing does have the capacity to be able to record internally. So let's say for whatever reason, the stream from the transmitter to the receiver to your camera cuts off, you have the capacity to record that audio internally on the transmitter. And then in post, you can sync that together. So it's just kind of like a safety feature that you know that you can always rely on um, if anything goes wrong, which is just great because that's what you want it to be, to be 
to provide some sort of reliability. So just like everything else in the world, this thing is not perfect. And I have one major problem with this thing, the magnet. This thing has a weird way of looking around your, your body and neck. Now, maybe that's a design issue. Maybe it's, I, I, blah. I don't know, but I just know that it does not always look good, which is why I flipped it around in terms of how I use it, because it's, it's just worse when the mic is here and it's just dragging down on your shirt. But other than that, I feel like this thing is rock solid. Usually on my YouTube channel, I use the Samsung CO2 mic, which is an XLR microphone, and I plug that into my Zoom H5 to be able to get good quality audio. But I'm curious, how does that sound compared to this. Let's see. This video is not sponsored. I paid for this in cash. My thoughts are mine and mine alone. This video is not sponsored. I paid for this in cash. My thoughts are mine and mine alone. And perhaps the most impressive feature um, of this microphone to me is just the multiple use cases. You can plug this into your iPhone. You can use it for podcasting. You can use it as a sound recorder. You can even plug this straight up into your computer um, to get better audio into your Zoom, into your Skype, into whatever online uh, webinar meeting that you are doing. It's not gonna give you the same sound as in a studio environment, but well, if you're buying this, you're not planning to use this in the studio environment. You want to be outdoors. You want to be running, gunning, quick interviews, grab sound bites, and things like that. And this thing is perfect. It makes things a lot more easier, um, which I think is the core selling point of this DJI mic is the fact that it's very practical, it's easy to use, and you can use it in multiple places. It's so easy to get your files off of this, unlike some of the other systems out there. So function-wise, this is what this thing offers. It offers usability for multiple use cases, and that's the biggest value about this thing. Uh, 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 let's go, give me 20, give me 20, give me 20, uh-uh. I wanna be able to do this. If I'm sat here, I'm not, I don't know if you can still see me, but is it gonna pick up my heartbeat? We, oh my God, what if this thing picks up my heartbeat? This might also be a range test, you, you never know. I'm just saying, especially when I'm moving, you know, can you hear anything against my shirt? I mean, outside of the fact that, yes, I do wanna use it on client interviews and other essential things like that, but we don't care about that. What we care about is the intangibles, like walking away from the mic, why am I saying microphone? People say it looks like the airports of microphone. And still talking and getting crisp, clean audio. Well, the AC is just right above me here, so. Okay, oh, by the way, subscribe to my channel. We're almost at 600 subscribers, so I appreciate it if, if you subscribe um, and get me to 600 or perhaps more. Appreciate that, appreciate y'all. Love, peace, bye.